Okay, part two of the bathroom boudoir session, okay? Um, you're probably wondering why I'm in my sitting room. Well, that's because in my bathroom, I've got curtains. I don't have a glass shower door or shower wall like most people do. So um, that's why I took advantage of the one that was in the hotel. I've got a couple other ideas if you're like me and you've got shower curtains. So we're gonna use my back door and I am going to show, we're gonna pretend that this is like a shower door, okay? Thank God it's not 20 degrees out today open this let's see where can I set this there we go that should work just fine okay so we were talking in the last video I'm trying to get that where you guys can see about doing this pose right so body up against this leg is bent ass is out stomach is in boobs are out we're very close to the window, but we're not touching. We're just right up next to it. And then you're either gonna put a hand here and one in your hair. You can do two hands. You can put one across your chest. And you're gonna do all of this while you're videoing, okay? Um, and then when you're done, you're gonna take screenshots. You can crop off the edges, and you don't need any editing software to do that. Now. I'm going to do another video probably next week to teach you how to edit the selfies and show you what like app that I use. It's the only editing app that I use. But that is like what we did in the first tutorial. I'm trying to get this set up better so you guys can see. Let's see. Maybe, because I need you to be able to hear me too. Um, whatever shall I do? Maybe this work, go this way. Oh, it's, that actually might work better. I think that's gonna work better than the way that I had it. Okay, move my side table. So now the next move, this was the one that was like, got a little spicier, okay, is you're going to press, right? So shower, you put one hand here, one there. You want those nipples up against the glass, okay? <laughs> now this is nice for us that have had babies because if you need to, you can like pick them up. Like we, can, we can get them where we need them and then smash them. Now obviously the shower door isn't gonna move. This one's moving on me, so I'm holding with my toes. But put one thigh the boobies, the hands, and get your face as close as you can to it without smashing your face because you don't want to look like a smushed bug, okay? So now you can zoom in here. You can crop this. We can keep it from the belly button up. We can do the full Monty. That's up to you and what you're comfortable with and all of that. But this is, this is what we're going for, okay? So... Turn your face, always sort of keep it up. Suck in the tummy, okay? We're gonna suck in the tummy. We're still sort of pushing our butt out because we got our boobs against the glass. Arm up, hand down here, face turn, thigh touching, like that is going to blow his mind. Now, if you're like me, I don't have a glass shower and I want to do something like this, but I don't want to just send like a, eh. Do you have a throw? If you have a throw, that's all you need. We are going to have a window behind us. Now, typically, this is obviously good light, but for boudoir, you want it to be sort of moody and shadowy. So this is fine. We are going to set this here. We're gonna be in front of the window. You're gonna strip down. You're gonna hold this against your body. Maybe let a little nip slip if you want. Maybe hide the cash and prizes there. Hand here, head back, arm up. Do you see? And that's gonna give you a little bit, you could stand like this 
your legs sort of spread holding this. Butt out, don't lean, like, don't lean your hips forward. We're always doing, see, when I stand like this versus how slimming it is, just that little bit. So we want ass out, just remember, back it out. Hold this up here, or you could hold it with one. Let part of you show. Hand here, hand there. And you're just gonna video this, okay? We're gonna take videos the whole time, and then you're gonna go through and you're gonna screenshot. And that's gonna be the full shower selfie tutorial. Um, trying to think if there's anything I'm missing. We'll talk more about angles and lighting. For me, obviously, this is better lighting. If that dark, moody, I love the silhouette look when it comes to boudoir. So I, I'm always gonna have the window behind me when I do those, but if you prefer the more uniform lighting, stand in front of the window. Put your phone between you and the window. Same thing. You're always, just think like butt out, boobs out, tummy in. And then we're doing angles. You want angles. Hold, see, got an angle here. If your arm is here, you don't want it just hanging. You don't want this. Look at the difference in the shape of my arm. We want our arm away from our body, okay? So arm out, arm out, arm up, arm up. Angle, angle, angle. See? And then we're just screenshotting. It's so fun and it's so easy. You can do this. Okay. Hope you enjoyed this. Subscribe, um, follow, like, comment, save, all the things. Tag a friend because this could be like having a partner in crime. I had so much fun with my girlfriends in New Orleans because I did these and then showed them and they were like, OMG. <laughs> and so then they wanted to know what I did, how I did it. Then they did their own and I got to see theirs and I was like, OMG. It's so fun to have a partner in crime. So find a girlfriend that'll do this with you that you're comfortable like going back and forth with because it's so fun. It is so much fun. Makes you feel sexy and alive. Sparks your marriage. Husband feels invigorated. You feel desired. It's just all the good things are happening. Um, I mean, we've been together 20 years. So like keeping things alive, right? Like gotta keep that, that fire going. Um, like I said, stay tuned. I will be doing more of these. I will be doing some on the bed. I will be doing some on the floor. We'll be doing different poses, different lighting. And like I said, I will share a video on simple ways to edit this that really help with the lighting. Um, I've got one app that I use to edit all of my photos. So it's not like you're gonna have to buy a dozen different apps and I don't work with the app company. Uh, so it's not like a sales pitch. It's just what I prefer to use. If you have an app that you love, then use your app. <laughs> all right, that's it for today. Uh, that is what tutorial number two bathroom selfie edition